Hi, welcome to Learning Monkey. I am Vikram. In this class, we will try to understand nested queries in SQL. So, the concept of nesting the queries is also available in queries, just like the for loops. Nesting the for loops, the queries can also be nested. So, we will take our uh, first example on uh, joins where uh, we have already understood this uh, example. Uh, write a query to find the names of the employees who work in research department. So this query we have already seen and uh, the query for this is uh, this is the query uh, where e dot d number is equal to d dot d number and d name is equal to research. So this is the condition and uh, uh, the, the tables that we have to take is employee and department. So uh, these two tables will get Cartesian product. All these concepts we have discussed and we have un clearly understood about how to write these kind of queries. And uh, there is another possibility to write the same query that is nesting a query within another query. See, uh, this is the example for nested queries. This is the inner query and the output of this query, the output that we are going to obtain from this query will be produced as the input for the conditions that are there for this query. So in order to, so uh, here we have combined both the departments and the conditions were also written based upon those conditions, uh, based upon the conditions or based up, uh, the conditions are written based upon the uh, columns and the availability of uh, different types of columns. Uh, we have we have written these conditions and also the relationships. Okay, here uh, sorry, the relationship is between D number of employee and D number D N of employee and uh, D number of department. So uh, uh, this is how we have written this query. In this uh, nested queries, what we will do is we are not going to combine the queries. So uh, these are the two tables that are involved as we know that the two tables that are involved are employee and department, employee and department. So what we will do is first uh, uh, we will take one of the table and he, uh, we will take uh, uh, in our case we will take department table and wherever the D name is equal to research, wherever the D name is equal to research and uh, we want we we are going to get the d number so uh, we have only one department by name research and uh, the department number of that uh, uh, department research is 5 so the output of this query is 5 and this 5 is up to, this 5 is provided as the input for this condition so where d number is equal to 5 so here it is directly given. So wherever D number is equal to 5. So in these four cases, we are going to select the F name and the L name. Simple. So these are the two simple uh, uh, single queries, uh, single table queries. And those are combined. They, those, are, uh, uh, those are written uh, in the nested form. Means a query in a query. So those are written in the query uh, uh, in the nested form and the output of the innermost query in our case we are having only one uh, one inner query and this output of this query is obtained as the input is provided as the input for this uh, uh, condition and uh, now we are going to execute we are, we are going to uh, uh, get the F names and L names of these employees whose department number is equal to 5. Okay. So uh, this is how this is how the nested queries will work and we will try to execute the same query on our computer and see what is the output of this query uh, and how it is going to get displayed see here. So here uh, here is the query the same query uh, the output is also same Franklin Wong Ramesh Narayana and Joyce English and uh, John Smith. So this is how the nested queries can be written and it is very easy to write nested queries are very easy to write when compared with joins. In joins we have to think of all the all the kind of uh, uh, relations that are there and based upon that which are to be related uh, and from that we have to uh, uh, decided uh, from that we have to decide uh, um, so to get 
uh, the details uh, writing the queries is bit difficult when compared uh, with nested queries so this is all about nested queries hope you got the clarity on this concept thanks for watching if you haven't subscribed to our channel please subscribe to our channel and press bell icon for the latest updates and if you have any doubts regarding this concept please post your doubt in the comment section below if you feel that this video is helpful to you please give us a like symbol and please share this video with your friends so that they will also get benefited thanks for watching